Alrighty guys, good afternoon, more medic one. Today we're working on a little WYK wall barrel carburetor. Super simple carburetor to tear down and diagnose. We're gonna take the rotor out of it first. And just slide it up out of there. And we can see the emulsion tube. But let's get into the meat and potatoes of it. And the reason that this carburetor failed, or wasn't working properly, I should say. If you remember, this is the one that got ran without a fuel filter. Here is your primer check valve. You can check and make sure it's working. Here is your primer base assembly. And here is your metering diaphragm. And this thing is rock hard. And this is the probably the main cause of it running out of fuel while it's running. This needs to be pliable and not hard like that. Here's your fuel pump diaphragm and gasket. And it's the same way. You don't want this gasket, this diaphragm, to be hard as a rock. It has to be able to move. Now I've already taken the inlet fuel filter out of here so I could show you if you can see it all the crap built up underneath the filter hold it in a couple of different ways so you can see it here's your needle in your seat here's the seat the needle goes through here and basically this is your diaphragm metering and our your uh, yeah your metering diaphragm gasket these aren't too bad about going bad but they do they will leak here if you're not careful an old timer trick used that we used to do we used to soak these gaskets in these diaphragms in wd-40 before we assembled it and it did help out quite a bit but guys i just wanted to make this real quick little video of a teardown of a wy series wall barrel carburetor if you have any questions about these little carburetors, let me know. More Medic One. Have a great day.